I have a problem. My name is Crystal and I have a problem. I buy everything from Facebook ads and Instagram ads. Not a joke. This necklace, Facebook ad. This Gucci thing, Instagram ad. This tower of shoes, Facebook ad and Soul Society. I don't know if anyone else is out there feeling personally victimized by Soul Society like I am, but Soul Society has been doing a ton of advertising lately and I got sucked in. So this is what 500 bucks at Soul Society looks like. I love shoes. I love shoes. I love shoes. I love shoes. By the way, hi, welcome back. I didn't even say hi because I'm just so excited to show you all of the shoes I got. If you follow me on Instagram, you remember the day these came in and I put them on stories and I was like, you guys, I didn't even, I, I blacked out and I bought eight pairs of shoes and I didn't even remember that. And then I just started screaming because I was trying them on and I was dying. Um, so yeah, that was fun. But the first pair that I got were the ones from the ad that I saw. And I, I mean, like I could not resist the color. So these are the Cerulean Blue. I remember that because of Devil Wears Prada. Cerulean Blue um, Velvet Flats with these little tie bits. They remind me of the pink ones I got from Just Fab earlier in the month. But um, these are blue and they don't have a little heel, so that's great too. These are so cute. Oh my God, oh my God. I hate being that, that person on YouTube that's like, oh my God, this is so cute. But like, what else am I supposed to say? They're adorable, they're precious. Um, so I haven't really shopped Soul Society at all. And the more I played on their site, the more I was like, wow. Everything here is very like ladylike, pretty, elegant, gorgeous. Just really, really excited about it. And everything was under $100. Some things were on sale. I don't remember what I paid for everything, but everything will be linked down below. I got eight and a half in everything and they all fit amazing. So I'm very, very pleased with that. But I could not resist this color. Like look how it shimmers and oh my God. What a beautiful, beautiful color. They're gonna go with so, 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 so much. I've already been wearing the pink ones a ton from Just Fab, so I'm super excited to bring this beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous shade of blue into my collection. The next pair I got, Soul Society seems to be pushing, like, to no end in their ads right now. I don't know what it is, like, I, I feel like they should know that I already bought these, so don't, like, keep telling me to buy them. I already bought them. Um, oh, <laughs> They're like little princess loafers. Oh my God. So what color are these? What is it called? Dusted plum? Yes, please. So gorgeous. Setting that down. Um, they have little jewels on the top. They are just so friggin' pretty. They're nice, like they're not wide, but they're not narrow. Like I, I have like a, a medium, like an average foot, and they fit just beautifully. So if you have an average foot as well, these will probably work really well for you. I love this color. This is such a chic little shoe. This is a good little airport shoe, but this is also good for like running errands or if you're like going to a meeting or something, or you have like maybe PTA and you're like going to talk to like the school about your kids or whatever, and you need to look a little more put together. These are so great because they have the comfort of a flat and then all of this like jewelry business on them. Oh my God, I love them. We packaged them back up. Um, I wore them like for five seconds. They're so freaking adorable. I think I'm gonna wear these. I have to go out to a meeting shortly and I think I'm gonna wear these with my jeans and like a little black t-shirt or something um, because that would be really adorable. There's gonna be a lot of adorable, cute, and oh my God, and a lot, maybe a lot of squealing in this video. So if that makes you uncomfortable, go ahead and check out the video up here and move on to something else because I love shoes and I'm gonna squeal a lot. So I have to admit when it comes to shoes, I tend to be a purist. I like a good pointed toe heel or good pointed toe flat. And I like to be like basically left alone from there unless there's something like outstanding going on or like a little, a little thin like open toe sandal. But these next ones, I saw them and I think it's the color is what makes them so chic because I have a feeling like in other colors this could go like very wrong very quickly. But in this color combination, which they are calling cream, Okay, um, which they are not cream to me, but whatever. Um, this is so chic, you guys, so gorgeous. So um, modest heel, open toe sandal, but they've got like this little, oh my God, it's so soft. This little bit of faux fur on the where the toe goes. So it's like boudoir, but classy. I love the shade of this. I love this like kind of mauvey brown base that they've done with the, I guess the cream is referring to the fur. Um, it's obviously faux fur, you guys. Um, so freaking beautiful. Like I just, 
oh my god I can't say enough good things about this shoe so if you're someone that like wants a statement shoe but you're still pretty reserved and you're more of like a Kate Spade than like a v Roberto Cavalli for example um, this is just a look how stunning that is oh my god I'm, I'm obviously in certain clips I'm just I love these shoes and I love that the heels not too high either so a really nice like three and a half inch heel so comfortable to wear um, and oh god these are so pretty oh I just I never I never cuss on my channel and like these are the ones you guys these are the ones okay this next pair is because I am I'm still obsessed with Hawaii I'm still obsessed with the beach um, I'm already planning my Hawaii trip I need to start a countdown because it's happening pretty soon I'm excited but I saw these orchid shoes I don't know if they're orchid the color or if that's an orchid on them um they yeah Hawaiian orchid oh my god the name of the shoes are the colors called Hawaiian orchid um I'm obsessed I love these they're really really sweet my favorite thing is obviously this orchid detail here on the shoe I don't like a lot of crazy things on my shoes but this is just so peachy Ugh, they're so so gorgeous and again that like mid heel three and a half um, we're not quite I don't like to wear shoes that are four inches or more because first of all they I can't they hurt my knees really really badly um, But also they're just uncomfortable, but this height is so beautiful and this little floral detail It's just enough. It's like Hawaii enough So if you're wearing like a solid color dress like not red But if you're wearing like white if you're wearing blue if you're wearing teal black whatever like you're on vacation Like these are just the prettiest little shoe to put with them. So a plus plus old society these are Gorgeous. Okay, moving on. I believe these were on sale because um, they're not typically a shoe that I would go for, but I got them and I feel like they're not as comfortable as I would like for them to be, unfortunately. But they are some really cute and nice to wear with jeans. So they are a mule with a chunky heel and then a bunch of ruffles, which is very, very pretty. The only thing that makes them uncomfortable to me is that I feel like the beginning and end, just like any slides that you get, they're like hard. So when you walk, they like kind of like they don't cut, but they dig in a little bit. So they're not like the most comfortable shoe in the world, but they are very pretty. Like they are really, really pretty. Um, I think I just need to break them in a little bit more. There's a, and there's an elastic right here that gives you like some flexibility, but they're super brand new, obviously. So they're a little, just slightly uncomfortable. So I just, I think I need to break them in a little bit more, but they are just so, so cute. Like just mm. these next ones are a pair of flat sandals that I really really liked I think these were on clearance as well um, these are really pretty they are very minimalistic which I like when I'm wearing you know like a denim chambray kind of dress these are just really easy to throw on and slide on they are really nicely made and they have a kind of an architectural style bow wrap and they've got like a, what is this like a chambray it's like a denim and white like ribbony i don't know what it's made out of but it's really really pretty um i like this i like a good neutral sandal that's got like a very simple pattern on it these are just going to be a really good pair of everyday sandals as the weather gets a little warmer here in arizona they're gonna go great with dresses they're gonna go great with cutoffs with jeans whatever you're wearing these are just gonna be a really nice go-to sandal and they have that again that architectural kind of bow to them that makes them more stylish than sweet if that makes sense um and yeah i really i just really really like them i don't have a lot to say you guys i'm just very excited about all the shoes and i cannot wait to wear them all and i love them you know normally when i spend this much money there's a big part of me that like just gets angry and is like how dare i how dare i like when i bought this i was like how dare you like how dare you but then i put it in my hair and i love it and the world is right again so you know here we are Ooh, these next one okay i think it's because i came across like sex in the city episodes recently that i saw these and i was like oh my god they're like carrie's manolos which you know hashtag 20 years ago um but they are so beautiful the color of these is mahogany rose these are really great again a nice like three inch heel look at the oh buckle on these here's the thing with the carry shoes from sex in the city is that this kind of a shoe is timeless it's ageless 
It's so pretty. Um, I love this, well again, this mahogany rose, this like muted rose, again, velvet or suede color. I love how pretty this is. This is just like, this is a lady, this is a lady shoe. I'm calling this my lady shoe. This is like when I need to be a lady. Like this is the shoe that I'm going to wear. This is my lady shoe. So, so cute. Again, great fit on these. There's a padding on the inside so they make them really comfortable. The heel's obviously not high. Um, just a very chic, very sophisticated shoe that I can definitely see pulling out for date night a lot. This last pair I'm actually particularly excited about because I've never had a shoe in this color before. And the more I look around at my wardrobe and the more I look around at like the things that I'm wearing and the things that I'm liking, the more I see this fitting into my shoe wardrobe so seamlessly and seeing it elevate so many outfits that, you know, I felt like I've been fine wearing a new shoe, but like this is kind of like elevating it and it makes me very happy. Um, so these are army green mule, not mule, slingbacks. I think that's the name of the color. Um, they're just calling them dark olive. They're a satin, like mid heel, so that three, three and a quarter inch mark. They're so beautiful, you guys. They have this knot tie in the front. The satin is very loose and this is adjustable, so we have a lot of space here in, in an eight and a half. Um, God, they are so pretty. I have been pulling a lot of, um, um, animal print lately. Sorry, I'm like very excited about the shoes. I've been pulling a lot of animal print lately and I could definitely wear a new shoe with that and you definitely can, that's great. But when I put this olive shoe, this army green shoe with my leopard, with my tiger print, with any other kind of animal print that I have, it adds a level of sophistication. It adds a, like just a different element to the whole look that elevates it to a different level that even I didn't know that they needed to be because I'm really comfortable wearing a nude shoe with just about anything. But this has proven to go with so many things in my wardrobe that I, like I'll just like put them on and they'll just throw dresses on or throw outfits on and start working with them. And every time I'm like, this green shoe is perfect. This green shoe is perfect. I just keep coming back to it. Um, it's also available in a ton of other colors. I believe it comes in like a blue, a pink, a yellow, which is really gorgeous but this green just really stuck out to me as very unique very different and very freaking comfortable i will say across the board other than the ruffled mules which i need to break in i think i'll update you guys um in like a month or so and let you know if they've been broken and how they're doing everything else has been so ridiculously comfortable that i'm shocked and i feel like soul society might be my new like go-to shoe brand um which is you know new and weird and exciting and God bless Facebook ads, right? Because I would have never gone to Soul Society site. I would have never checked them out. I would have certainly never placed a $500 order um, in the middle of the night, which I probably shouldn't have done anyway, but here we are. Um, you guys, these shoes are to die for, and I love them. Okay guys, so that is it for me and this $500 on Facebook ads shoe haul. Um, I love them. Let me know if you wanna see more of this kind of stuff in the future. Uh, again, it is a problem. The, the Instagram and Facebook ad shopping is a problem. We're working on it. I may or may not have bought one of those glass water bottles with the crystal in it because I'm a sucker for Facebook ads. So, you know, let me know what you guys think and if you want me to keep doing videos like this. And let me know what your favorite pair of shoes was down in the comments down below. I can't pick. My least favorite is the ruffles. My most favorite, probably the olive ones, but God, I just, I felt like I just kept winning and winning and winning with every box that I opened and I was just very, very excited about it. So I cannot wait to hear what you guys think. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you are. Thank you so much for spending a part of your day with me. I love you guys so much and you mean the absolute world to me. I'll see you next time.